What is going on, guys? We're back up in this bitch. We're gonna be doing a few things. We're gonna go out, kill a couple things, do some shit like that. Then at the same time, we're gonna be going out and we're gonna be doing a little bit of farming as well. There's a few things. Oh my god. Why am I just pegging like way over that freaking gator. Killed him. Hell yeah. I want that XP. That's it. I was just being greedy. So, we need to go out. We need to get a ton of bark, guys. Um, that was, like, the big thing that we need to farm. We need more hide as well. Uh, and then I kind of want to check out what's in that cave. We'll probably get the bark after. We probably won't do the farming at all in the beginning. Let's go out and let's go do some stuff. Let's kill some guys. Let's check out that cave. Explore a little bit. And then what we'll do is we'll come back. And then we'll kill some stuff on the way back, farm a little bit of bark, and hook our place up with all the hide, and then we could start making a ton of stretched hide. I think that's what it is. I think that's what we need. But are we doing, uh, yeah, we're doing good on eggs. Hell yeah. Let's go ahead and eat five. We're good, and we have water as well. Those little water cups. I like those things, man. I wonder if there's a way to, like, constantly get them i feel like they since they bring your health and or not your health your water all the way up i wonder if there's a way to kind of like continue on making them and shit you know what i mean i don't know if there's a way to kind of properly uh explain that i mean there is a way there's always a way let's kill this guy i don't like the way that you do that shit but we are gonna farm you Bam. Bam. Get rid of that crap. We don't have... Uh, yeah, we do not have any armor. See, what the fuck is that? What the fuck was that? What is that falling, dude? Is it just like some random graphics thing that they have that will like... You know, it's kind of like a boulder falling down or some shit? I don't know, man. I don't know. There's a lot of brimstone, though. We need a lot of steel as well. I don't know if there's anything in here that we need to be worried about besides the guys. Is it, if it's just three hits, these are guys. These are only level ones. So that's level one. I definitely like this camp in here, though. There's a ton of brimstone, though, man. We might have to go balls to the wall and just farm brimstone in here. We have so much tar that we could easily. That's a carpenter. No ammo. What? Shit. We already went through 200. Um, how are we on sticks? We're, we got no sticks. Oh my god. We're going to be right back. <laughs> we got to run out here now and collect a little bit of sticks. And collect a little bit of stone. Oh my god. Well, it looks like I'm going to have to fucking go balls to the wall with a fucking hatchet for a second. Excuse me. Um, we could be friends. You don't have to do this, man. I'm sure you don't have to do it. Stop it. <laughs> Shit. Yeah, I was hoping that there was not, or there wasn't another one. All right, so let's go ahead and grab a couple of sticks, guys. Sounds like it's something stuck in there. I don't want to grab a fuck ton of stupid resources, but honestly, we need an absolute. Sounds like there's a fucking hyena inside of that rock. Did you hear that? I don't know if I can... I don't know if it, if it's loud enough for you guys, but it sounds like there's a fucking hyena inside of that shit. We're gonna find out. Look at that! The freaking hyena was stuck in there. What the fuck happened? What? That is so fucking random, dude. Alright. 
So we're getting 200 sticks all together. Or 200 sticks. What the fuck am I talking about? We're getting 200 arrows all together. Don't really need any more than that. Let's go ahead and venture in. Let's check this shit out. We did clear out that force. Forced. Alright, so these guys are already spawning in. You don't have to do this. This is level 2 guy. So, level 2 guys right now are taking 3 hits. What? Serious? I do want that. I forgot to actually check. So, there's some dry wood. Uh, baked wood ready to burn. So, I wonder if it actually lasts longer. I don't know. That is something that I want to start gearing for. Is with the drying rack. Is start getting some dry wood. Um... I kind of wish I had... Oh my god, look at the brimstone right there. Dude, that's a nice spot. Let's go ahead and check a little bit. I've never been in here, so I definitely want to look at it. and see if there's anything in here. I'm probably going to run into a fucking boss, I bet. Um, actually, I'm pretty sure we will. I'm pretty sure we're going to be... Uh, we're going to be heading up. I don't know if it will or not, but it could be taking us right there. That is a that's a pretty far journey. I'm not gonna lie though. And if we are fighting a boss, I am not kidded for it. We're so close though to level. Come on, have some armor. This may seem a little, a uh, little excessive to go out and get some iron. Ooh, they got dancers in here too. They got big deposits of freaking brimstone, man. This is a nice place for brim. Holy shit. I didn't even realize how good this cave was. Alright, so. Clearly, that guy's glitched. You don't have to do it, buddy. All right, I told you. Brimstone for days. Got an archer here. Oh, it's a level three archer. What? Dude. So level three guys are up here? Fuck yeah. What the hell is this? See, under the delicious broth human okay so these must be cannibal guys uh, i don't really care about that crap let's go over here how's my health my health's good this is a nice little place i don't know if you guys can see it that well though so it's a priest Yeah, I'll take a trophy. Look at that shit. That's fucking awesome. Hell yeah, it's gnarly as fuck. Now, is there some chest or something in here? Like you boys holding out on something? Besides uh, a little trophy? I was kind of hoping I would find something else. I was kind of hoping actually it would bring us to the boss a little bit. Because I kind of wanted to fight the boss. Um. Well, we're in here. There's a lot of brimstone. I don't see any iron, though, sadly. Um, we did level, so let's go ahead and go here. Let's bring archery all the way up to that. So grit is the stam pool. Um, but we do want to start doing our health a little bit more. Bring that shit up. Let's go ahead and check. 36. Let's go out and get iron. Uh, I think that's something that we will need. I know I said bark, but, guys, I think the iron is something that we need to kind of focus on all together. Um at the moment i know we need a ton of it making sure that nobody's spawning in right here i like that dude tier three guys in here that is nice i know that's going to take a little bit more to be able to get those guys yeah, oh all together it's going to take a lot more to be able to uh a lot longer i'd imagine to be able to farm them and hopefully we're not going to run right out into some shit Try to make sure we're not running into high enough and stuff. Pain 
is dead. Um, so, I want to be able to start really getting like a good farm train going when it comes to a lot of the resources that we are going to be needing. A major resource that we're going to constantly need is the iron so we can make steel. Fuck. Let's see if we can go ahead and get this guy. So it's something that we're going to need is a lot of iron so we can get steel. And the reason why you need steel, it's definitely for the next tier. I mean, clearly, uh, it's something that we are going to need for that. Uh, but sadly, a big part of uh, getting the steel is by farming a metric shit ton of iron. And iron is something that is... At the moment, it's going to be one of the biggest things that we need. But at the same time, we do need to go out and start getting a ton of wood, bark, and things like that. So we can continue on making better gear and better buildings. And the reason why we need the bark is because, again, we need to dry it. We need to be able to get the resin from the wood. And then I think it's each piece of wood is one resin. So we get a stack of wood, dry it. That is quite a bit of resin that we're going to get all together so that, that's that's at least the idea and i'm hoping that that's the way to do it in the south because if i have to go up north to get resin that's not going to happen not for a while and i really want to be able to make a better base altogether. um and you should be able to i mean you unlock tier two so early there's the hyena i i don't even think i'm going to be able to hit it Fuck it. I don't even know why I'm even trying to. Let's go ahead and get some iron. And one more hit. No, nope. two more hits. There we go. And then we'll farm this bad boy. But a big thing is we're going to have to do constant iron iron runs for now on. I'll do a lot of it off cam so you guys don't have to see it. I know some people, again, some people have been complaining a little bit about um, the whole thing about, you know, being on cam and a lot of farming is being done on it. And I get, I, I, you know, I understand like how that can maybe be a little frustrating. Like you just want to see the action party. You want to see the builds and stuff like that. And I, you know, I, I fully understand it. And I, and I kind of do agree, you know, when it comes to a certain spot, but, um, at the same time, I kind of like it being a part of this series because it allows me again to kind of talk to you. I know this is something that we've discussed a lot and I will cut out some spots when it's just all oh, what the episode is is just constant farming or something like that i'm definitely gonna go in and just be like you know okay so we need what we need to do is just kind of get rid of a lot of that and then maybe do something different you know something like that so i got 80 there so we'll drop that so we can run and we'll go ahead and run back we do need to go out we do need to get quite a bit of silk or the little stream from the spiders. I know where there's a great place to farm spiders. There is a way to make a farm trap that I noticed. And I believe that one of the guys that uh, were commenting stuff in the PvE series was letting me know about this cave. And when he was letting me know about the cave, I think he was kind of implying that either I can go there and fight them and kill them, or I can go there and make a farm. So I got to kill them, then make this little way so they can't get out of the cave. And then I just sit there and constantly just shoot into it and just pretty much kill them the whole time. So let's go ahead and start running as well down here. That is a great idea, though, to do that because it's a great way to be able to not only gain XP, but it's a great way to get silk. And that's going to help us, again, further on down the road. You need silk for a lot of stuff that is later on in the game. So that's something that will be great. Kind of want to go over there and see if that rhino is there again because I want to see if we can level. I was hoping this... Uh, this episode would be level 37, or only 36, and we just pretty much hit it. I, we could always go out and start farming and killing a bunch of people at certain places and stuff, but let's go ahead back. By the time we get back, it'll probably pretty much be daytime. The night cycle in this game is insanely fast. I, I didn't even touch day and night. Like, this is literally how, like, it's just in the game. I barely saw that guy, too. I don't know, man. That's my Xbox Elite controller. I just want to remind you guys that keeps veering up like that. <laughs> I put so much fucking work into this sucker. Probably going to need some new joysticks or something like that. Or just a completely new thing. Why is there a light coming from there? Let's go ahead and walk over here. 
over here. We got the guy. We do need to go out and get another guy as well. So let's go ahead. And what we're going to do is we're going to place three in there. And then three in here. And this will allow us to smelt faster. And all that. So let's go ahead and start that. Start that. I do need to get a blacksmith roll. That will be a great way to be able to do some stuff around here. I'll, I think it speeds up the process on a lot of this stuff as well. Um, let's see. Let's go ahead and get that. We can actually probably go out and find one. Let me, uh... Where's everything that I need? Do we have so much material scattered places? I need to go out and really rearrange this shit. Grab all that. And let's go and actually found, uh, find a blacksmith thrall. Carpenter thrall. Or something like that. You don't want to do this. You don't want to do this. You don't want to do it. I'm telling you. I'm like Crocodile Dundee up in this bitch, but I'll fucking end you, bitch. What? You back up. And then yet, he somehow hits you. The bastard. The sad thing is, I think I know where a blacksmith spawns. He's only level one. And the only thing that sucks about it is he's like all the way over there. <laughs> he's pretty far, I'm not gonna lie. So. How are we on all the material? We're, I think, on arrows. We should be good. I wish there's like a counter that could tell me how many arrows I have left. So let's go ahead and run out here. We'll swim across the water, and let's go find us a blacksmith. We need it. We need that. We need a carpenter, like I said. Probably a couple dancers as well. I want to kind of go in the corruption area. Again, if you guys don't know where the corruption area is, right there. Look at that ugly. Piece of shit. All right. You know what's gonna suck about this? All right, fighter. Is that we're gonna have to really run up and check these guys? All right, so we'll go ahead and just take out all these guys. I need my armor. I am taking pretty... A lot of damage. <laughs> to just summarize it all together. I'm taking a lot of damage. I can't believe how much I'm taking, actually. Uh, what am I looking at? Arrows. Okay, yeah, we're good on arrows. I do need to start going out and grabbing a bunch of this. We need seeds. I'm going to make gruel again for these guys. It's probably not the best thing for them to eat, but fuck it, dude. They're getting it. Actually, you know what? We're going to test the theory with steaks. What we will do is we'll grab them, put them inside of the thing. We just won't start the process yet. And what we will do is go out, kill a couple hyenas, grab their steaks, the meaty ass steaks, and then we'll cook them and we'll throw them in there. And we'll see if that will actually cut down the problem, uh, the process. I wish they would have a timer altogether, but sadly they do not. If they did, that would make this a little bit easier to be able to recognize how quick and you know you could be able to that's when you can start judging shit instead of kind of like just timing it yourself it's maybe it, you know it's kind of nice to be able to figure that stuff out but then at the same time sometimes it's just you don't have the overall time to do it there we go i'm pretty sure that guy's dead it's hard to talk and fight i'm not gonna lie at least for me i'm not one of these people that's like mlg pro i'm one of these people that's like i'm an amateur hi my name is chris and i'm an amateur just not pouring anything. That should be a blacksmith right there. Alright, yes, yeah, so you can hit me as much as you want. Just hit me. Yes, hit me. Do it! Sorry, buddy. Don't die. Are you dead? Oh, God. Don't be dead. You're not dead. All right. We're good. I'm taking you with me, buddy. You're my friend now. And I'm going to bring you to my swamp. I 
hell yeah. Got a blacksmith. Hopefully he can make it. <laughs> We're right actually over here where we built our PvE base. I believe our PvE base is right there actually. Yeah, it's, it's right there where those trees are actually. And we actually have a big bridge going across. If you guys haven't checked it out, check it out. PV, PVE, it's a, the main thing is about building. I've been focusing a lot on PvP though, so... At the, at currently, I'd, I don't know which one's further, honestly. Well, th this guy's level overall is a lot further along than uh, the PvE. Because the PvE, I was doing just base. Like, stats, everything was just basic. And I decided to bump it up because of how quickly we were going through this. And it was a lot more enjoyable. Less grindy. That's a big thing. Um, and it, it always kind of sucks whenever you're doing the whole grinding out and shit. So, let's go ahead and bring this guy along. Oh, don't say somebody's attacking me. Alright, let's go ahead. You cannot run. Wow. Alright. Well, kind of sucks because we're pretty far away from the base. I'm hoping this guy doesn't wake up or anything. Oh, we still got him. I think it's a pretty decent time, though, too, as well. We might just throw the gruel in there, just do the gruel with this guy. Um, I do know you can sit there and give them certain things. I saw that somebody did comment. Somebody saying you can give them better weapons and stuff like that. I wonder if you can give them some armor. I'm not exactly sure. i got to kind of look at the thralls. Um, if you can give them armor, that would be great. Give them some bows. Give them some nice arrows. Maybe a crossbow. Fuck them up a little bit. There we go. There's the blacksmith. All right, so let's go ahead and turn this bad boy on. He's going to take a bit. And then let's come over here. We're going to throw all of this. What are you doing, my dude? Oh, so you can... So you can kit this guy out with armor and everything. That is nice. I like that. Alright. But. We do not have. Oh my god. There's so much meat fucking spoiled in there. Alright. Let's run over here. So that actually doesn't do anything. We'll throw that in there. Increase the burn time. That'll allow that to go more. Uh, more. Now that's a blacksmith, so I wonder if we gotta get a forge. What is this? Thrall. Will it tell me what type of thrall I need? No, it doesn't. But this is for the blacksmith, and we could throw a blacksmith thrall there. So hopefully that's something we can do. Got 45. Got 45, so sweet. We're smelting. We're smelting away, guys. So, at least we got a new thrall. And we need to go out and get a little bit of bark and everything. We're all pretty much full on a bunch of random shit. Eat that, fucking bring that almost all the way up. I'm gonna start fucking flying through this pick, though. That's, that's the one issue whenever you are farming. Especially for, like, bark and shit. You go through this stuff so quickly. Sorry. That's it, Tim. You get a ton of wood by doing this. Need to actually... You know what? I actually know exactly what I'm going to do. How much twine do I have? We're going to make a couple... Just a couple... Of these bad boys. And I'm the only one. What? Is it the wood that we're missing? I thought we are actually pretty much set on wood. Let's go ahead and kill this hyena. We're definitely going to be leveled the next, uh... We're going to be leveled for the next one. For the drying rack and everything. But let's go ahead and chop up all of this. And then at the same time, what I'm going to do is I'm going to continue on making little storage boxes. Let's go ahead and... What we're going to do, too, is we're going to chop this guy up. I want to be able to get all that hide. I'm not exactly sure how much we have. I think that's enough, actually, a high that we need. And we're going to actually put up the trophy as well. So let's go ahead and get some bark, get some wood. Be able to make some stuff. 
how much wood are we sitting at? We got plenty of that too. So let's uh make three of those. It takes fourteen. And what we'll do is make a hundred and fucking fifteen of those. <laughs> make a ton of those stains. And let's get some more of this. So what we're gonna do is I'm a, I'm gonna be expanding that actually where these spikes are at. I'm gonna take over more of the area. The only issue is is that means there's gonna be hyenas that's gonna spawn in. And I'm fine with that. Uh, it's not that much of an issue or anything. I'm gonna be making a lot of camps and stuff around the general area. So we can actually use them for kind of like protection and stuff like that. Kind of like a buffer in between um, all of it. So we got a hundred. Now does that stack into just one? Okay, no, it separates it. So I want three stacks of the bark. Where the fuck is this other tree? In front of me. Now what we'll do is go down here. And make a couple more of these. So at the moment we can make five. And then after that, that's enough wood. And then we should be getting all the twine and everything as well. So, I wish there was a way to do it can like canceling. But, oh well. And we are sitting on quite a bit of twine. Get rid of that. I'm just going to roll in. I've been running some glitches a lot in PvE. And a big part of those are, like, stam glitches. So whenever you run out of stam, you start hearing, like, your guy, like, breathe really heavy and stuff. And it kind of, like, screen gets a little blurry and stuff like that. Well, I, f I finally f fucking realized that that's been an issue. And what will happen is if you continue on doing it, it will actually keep on kind of like staying like that like it, it will be a constant like heavy breathing you scream blurry stuff like that like come on we got to be almost on one of these things i'm trying to at least get a oh no we ha we do have 300 bark sweet i'm hoping that this will actually bring me out of the Alright, sweet. That actually did bring us out. And then what we'll do... Just chop up a little bit. To just get a little bit more. And then let's head back. What we're going to do is we're going to put all... Well, I, want, I need to make at least one more. But we're going to be putting all of the rest of the wood. And it won't be much. But we're going to put the rest of the wood down inside of the chest. And we're going to separate it kind of like that. And then we're going to start putting wood, stone, thatch, the twine... And things like that. So whenever it comes to later on, we can be able to have an abundance of it. Same thing in sticks and things like that. Um, let's see here. We're just going to put them right here for now. Actually, you know what? No, what we'll do. Not on the contact with the ground. You know what? Yeah, we're going to put it right here. I wish there was like signs. I'm sure there is. And there. This will allow us to be able to farm up quite a bit of shit. And this is when I can do a lot of stuff off cam or when I do cuts and stuff. I can kind of show you guys what we get all together as well. And whenever we go out and maybe do some looting with some uh, unfortunate others that's on the other team. Let's see. Uh, put that there. Put that there. Is that everything? Okay, that's everything. And let's come over here. Wanna run up here real quick. What was I gonna do with the bark is in here. So what we shall do is put you there. You there. You there. And then we're gonna put the three stacks of bark in there. And then we're gonna start it. So we're gonna have 366 being made all together. I'm pretty sure it's because of the bark is the reason why we're actually having less. Oh, and it actually stacks up. Fuck me. All right, well, we're just going to throw... Nope, actually, we're just going to throw that. <laughs> Shit. 
And the tar is going to be a good thing because we need a ton. And I mean an absolute shit ton of tar. So let's go ahead and then we'll put you there. there maybe we'll grab another one throw another one there so sweet guys i think that's uh i think that's gonna wrap it up this one's gonna be really, i don't know it's probably gonna be the same fucking amount <laughs> honestly these episodes are kind of long um so at least in this episode we got a little bit done we got a little bit more storage we got a blacksmith in here where we have been able to get all of the iron we got a nice beautiful thing there we were, we were able to check out what's in that cave we got our hide being made as well Killed a few things, leveled up. We are halfway through 36, so when we come back, we'll be able to go through to get 37, then we can get the drying rack. And then what we'll do is probably either make a few more of these, or we'll be able to make the new one. I believe what we're probably going to do is make a few more of those, we're going to scatter them throughout here. Uh, we're going to definitely redo the fucking shitty-ass tower up there. It's so hard to fucking flame this. That guy is so glitched. I need to fix him, too. I need to pick him up. And then we have our steel here and then what we'll do is we'll kind of turn that on be able to make more we got 108 being made at the moment we need so much of that honestly it's insane i gotta make a few more of those so we can get the farming going a little bit better uh but we're what we need to start doing guys we need to start building up this base a little bit more we need to definitely finish it all together as you guys can tell it's a pretty big one and it's gonna be it's gonna be multiple stories it's not gonna just be this one right here it's gonna go up again and we'll probably do the same thing further out. And what I'm planning on doing as well, I don't know how far these things went. So I went there. Maybe what we'll do is we'll build like a tower back here. So like right around, I don't know, if this is, yeah, so this is the center point. So what we'll do is we'll we'll make like a little tower from here. And we'll have it so it spirals up as well. And there's windows and shit so you'll be able to see out of it and things like that. So maybe we'll build a bridge to right there so we can go out there and uh, from the guys on the very top as well. But I think that's going to go ahead and wrap it up for this episode, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you guys did, don't forget to smack a like. And if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Guys, don't forget to go check out our Facebook page and our Twitter. Twitter will keep you up to date with everything that is going on. And as well as our Facebook page, there's some exclusive videos that we do up there. And when it comes to Conan related, there's none yet at the moment. I will be doing some up there as well. And I've been thinking about even making it so you get them kind of sooner than on YouTube. It's really no special privilege or anything for those guys, but it's kind of just to help promote that. So if you guys want to see these videos come out even sooner, go ahead and give us a follow and stuff like that. It's literally just search Stubborn Bucket and you guys should be able to find us. It's the same logo as the one that you have on the channel and stuff like that. But guys, I'll catch you all later. Hope you guys have a great day and deuces.